Hey guys, so um, really quick video. I'm super, super excited. So this week I've been um, PAing on a show that I'm really excited about. Um, I've been the COVID PA. I'm certified with the Safe Sets and with the John Hopkins uh, contact tracing. So I've been helping make sure that everything is just, you know, we're keeping people safe. Um, I know for my production, we've been having uh, really, really strict guidelines. So everyone is wearing their mask at all times whenever they are inside, but we're having frequent mask breaks where everyone goes outside, they get a drink of water, and they stand at least six feet apart from each other. They take off their mask and they breathe for a little bit. We're keeping everybody hydrated. Um, for every two bottles of water, then we have one with an electrolyte packet in it because when you sweat, you lose a lot of you know um, minerals and salts and sugar that's really important to keep everything working. Um, we also are sanitizing the entire set every single hour. And you know we're making sure that the PAs are the only ones that's handing out water. That's just a couple things that we're doing. But sorry, you can tell I'm excited. Um, so I have been working on set in the fall and winter. This is my first summer in film and I have not really had the best gear. Uh, so what I wore yesterday, here's the, um, I only have a couple shorts, I think. Really, you need a belt to put your walkie on. And then I also have right here where I put my hand sanitizer and my alcohol wipes. Um, so, you know, you need something you can work in that's comfortable, that's sweat wicking. So here's, I wanted to do a quick unboxing. Because I did some damage on Amazon to get some better gear for the summer. Ooh, the first thing we have, we have some Danish Endurance. Come on, get the glare. Danish Endurance Merino Wool Light Cushion Socks because I was running out of socks. Oh, these are designed in Denmark, tested by Olympic athletes. Oh, it has English, German, and French on the back. Mesh zones for breathability and ventilation, light cushioning for comfort, ankle brace keeps the sock in place. Mesh zonen für Atmungsak I can't do that. Zone de mel pour le respirabilité. Ah, excusez-moi aujourd'hui. Zone de mel pour la respirabilité et la ventilation. Un motif léger pour le confort. Renfort de cheville menti. Ah, c'est difficile pour moi aujourd'hui. Les chaussettes en place, matériaux, 40% laine merino. 30% acrylique et 28 nylon et 2% elastane. So, very excited about these. They seem to be a little bit scratchy, but I think that they're going to wear in a little bit. I'm actually going to put these on right now. Um, there's not a right or a left. Um, but yeah. I was wearing, I have a whole bunch of different kinds of, ooh. Okay, they feel scratchy in your hands, but when you put them on, they're actually pretty comfortable. But I have a bunch of these compression socks for in the winter. Ugh, my legs have been swelling when I've been on set, but they are way, way, way too hot. Okay, so I have three pack of those, and then, ooh, yeah. So, you really need a belt in order to um, hang just a bunch of stuff from it. Um, and normally, you know, in the winter, I'm wearing jeans which I have a space for a belt, but it is so hot. And you know, a lot of like girls shorts, like they're way too short or they're like really long and they're hot. And so a lot of people wear like athletic pants, but you know, it's hard to wear a belt with athletic pants. So getting a, this tactical belt, if I can figure out how to, oop. So, I mean, well, these are sweatpants. These are way too hot. But if I was going to be wearing like my yoga pants or something. Boop. Boop, boop. And then put these on right there. Tighten it. I wonder what I can do about this flippy flap. Hmm. Okay. I made this a little bit too big, so bear with me. 
wait. Oh, it comes with a little thing. I'm a dork, but we already knew that. Bam, bam, boom. And then I can take, I actually, I took some, so we have little alcohol wipe packs. And since I have to be walking down and um, sanitizing everything, I primarily have been, um, oh, I have another, another carabiner is a little bit bigger. But anyway, I take gaff tape and I put it on there so that I can just always kind of have it right here. I think it's smart. Okay, so that was the first pack. I got a ton of stuff. Okay, second, we have, ooh, I think these are my yoga pants. I got yoga pants because I only have like one pair. Oh my God, the static electricity on these. Um, I just got like um, a cheap pair. They seem to be kind of thick. I don't know how well they're gonna breathe, but they have pockets. So I pretty much just like chose one at random. Oh, and they ha it has an interior pocket right here. So yesterday, these would have been really good because we were out in the woods. Um, I don't know, I'm probably gonna wear like shorts today, but, cause phone pocket, the important, can put that there. Next up. And once I start getting my gear bag together, in case anyone's interested, um, I can show you guys like, what a good gear bag is for being on set. And then this. Oh, cool, cool. I, it took me a second. I was like just staring at it, sorry. These are neck gaiters. So I have, oh, crinkle, crinkle. I have a ton of masks that my mom made me that I've been getting a lot of compliments on. I'm gonna wear this one today. A bunch of cloth masks. Oh my God, I should do a mask try on haul. Look, it's a ladybug. Um, but some of the grips were wearing gaiters, which are kind of like scarves. And I really like how you can like pull these up and down. And these have um, uh, where you can put in a filter on the side. Oh, right there, there it is. Okay, so let me just pop this over my head. So it's like this. And then this seems to be a little bit Oh, uh, it's big on me. No. Oh, what am I going to do? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what I'm going to do about this. Maybe it's different if I put the filter in. So, I don't know. We'll figure this out. I might just wear the ladybug filter. Or the ladybug mask. I want, I've also been seeing on Etsy that there are these silk masks. Or you know what, these filters look really nice. I think they're washable too. So even if I don't wear the neck gaiter, I might just keep it for the filters. Cause I hate, I mean, if obviously if a product is defective, I'll return it. But like, I generally hate doing that because I don't want to create like a bunch of waste. And I feel like Oh wait. Weird. Okay, that's weird. It like fits if I have it on the side. But then if I don't, because of the way that it, that it does, I don't know, we're gonna have to figure that out later. Um, oh yeah, here are my shorts. Ooh, hold on, I'm gonna step off and try them on. And also, the nice thing about the web belt is that you can step off 
and you know you can use the restroom without taking your belt off. And then, oh, now you probably can't see that well. Yeah, I don't really think there's like a panty line or anything like that. I feel like a superhero. I feel ready to go. Got my, I think my belt. Um, probably have to make the belt a little bit smaller. Okay, everything's black, in case you couldn't tell. Um, and one reason for that is because, like, if you're right next to the camera, white can reflect light. So you don't want that to be like a liability. Oh, and here, some more sports bras. Great, because mine were getting sweaty, because again, I'm not, oh, let me tilt you up a little bit more. I'm not generally that active <laughs> outside a set. So this is like my one. Um, and I think I wore, I can't remember. I think I might've worn it earlier this week. So definitely I'm glad that those came in. Um, let's see what else. And then final box. Oh wait, I lied. See, I told you I got so much stuff. Um, ooh, here's my, um, it's a little bit longer. I like it. Huh. It's cute. It feels really like soft and smooth. I like it. Um, I'm going to take it off so that I can take the tag off though. And now, I, if this is in here what I think it is, it's very, very exciting. Well, if I can open it, um, stand by. Well, I get it. This is like an old eyebrow razor that I need to throw out. But it works. I have a pocket knife. I just, I think I put it somewhere because I, I, it needed to be cleaned and sharpened and then I can't find it. Too so much packing material. Yes, here we go. Tactical pouch for, um, so I didn't know which one I would like better. Yes, carabiner, very, very good. I didn't know which one I would like better. I think I got two because, you know, if I'm wearing these, I obviously have the option to put my phone in this, but this is for, you know, like, this one is more closed. So it has more like little pockets in here. And then I don't know what this purpose of that is, but. Oh, maybe phone. I'm not certain. But definitely, let's, oh, this way. Try this out. Boop, 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 boop. Because I need walkie, walkie batteries, um, I need a place, to, this is probably where I'm going to put sides and call sheets. Probably at sides and call sheets. Um, my hand sanitizer. Oh, I can use this for my hand sanitizer thing. Um, so in use for the, I also need hand, my hand sanitizer and my alcohol wipes. Um, a place to put my Sharpies and my, um, my pens and my pencils. And then, yeah, usually my keys too. Just, you know, it's, you gotta be, gotta be tactical. Gotta be, gotta be prepared. So then have 
this. Well, note to self, cut all this out. Oh, wait a second, do I? Okay, if I do this, I'm wondering if it would just make more sense to, yep. Slide it through there. You're a genius, Jessica. And then this other one, sorry, no, this is super loud, is a, it's a tank top in gray, like the other tank top that I got. Just to switch things up a wee little bit. I actually think I'm gonna wear this one today. And then finally, last, but certainly not least, and that's what I'm saying, I, I you know, I have a option. Um, do I want to do this one or the other? Well, now I really do need scissors. Hold on one second. Actually, the only thing I don't like, so it has, whoop, it has this clip right here, which I don't know is gonna be like, I mean, I guess it's good for ease of access putting things on, but, uh, well, I guess that's not that uncomfortable. But, and it also has this thing right here that it can go through it. So, cool, and it's big enough to do this. Sweet, sweet. I don't need two pouches, and this certainly is quicker for like, I don't know if you can see, you know, having this, 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 and this, whereas this is a little bit more secure for like zip pouch kind of thing. Hmm. I don't know where is this is like right here. I feel like this is a little bit overkill, TBH. This one right here. Whereas like I can get to everything that I need. Um, so I might return this. Oh my gosh, I have so much to clean. But yeah, I'm sorry. I know this is probably only interesting to me because um, I'm kind of pumped about it. But yeah, thanks for um, hanging out. And uh, this is kind of what I've been up to. This is my haul of uh, stuff. I'm probably gonna return that pouch because, um, you know, that I'm gonna be a little bit more active. Like, that might be good if I was like, I don't know, an, an art PA or if I had to have stuff like right there super active, but there's not really ever gonna be a time. Like, I'm not gonna be like working with my hands. Like, oh, I need to do this and like grab something right here. There's not really going to be a time that I can't get to this pouch and unzip it. It's not never like, whoa, 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 come on, go, go, go. Um, of course, you know, I've, I've been just going through like, I've been wearing just like Hanes shirts. Oh, and here's my, um, my headset. It's still attached. But my, this, this shirt started out the day white. Just want you to know, but we were filming at an alpaca farm. And the owner let me hold a baby alpaca. I have pictures. Uh, okay, yeah, you can see it's like all, oh wait, in the inside, come on. Yeah, it's all mucked up. So, you know, I do have tank tops, but it's gonna be nice to wear like a moisture wicking one. Um, I have to get going though, because the, it's about a 37 minute drive away and um, we have to be there at um, 1.30. No wait, no, we have to be there at 2.30, so I need to give myself time to drive and do that. Um, but, yeah, I'm excited still. I like the neck gaiters, especially because, you know, the like moving them on and off, like if I'm inside and then coming outside. Um, so I'm still on the hunt for good masks because I love the ones that mom gave me, but you know, I wanna have more options to like match them to different stuff. So yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. I know this is a, was a little bit of a crazy video. I just wanted to share my unboxing, so bye.